How did no one mention that? Back to... Two. One. Back to this, I guess. That should sound... Does that... How does that sound now? I was the only person in chat for an hour and I can't hear for shit. Could be. I was wondering, because it looked a little different. The, the, the... I don't know, the audio level looked a little different. Much better? Oh, sorry about that. That's fucked up though, that's weird. This should just be a direct feed. noticeable at least on the track that I was doing. Hopefully it doesn't sound that bad, but if it does, sorry. The Oh well. I'm just gonna like, can I just remove that? Every time I try to use the video capture directly, it's just a mess. I don't know why that's bad though, that shouldn't be bad. Because theoretically, like, that's the- that's the capture card, that's the thing I'm listening to right now, that's what you're listening to now, except filtered through my computer. So it should be... In theory, this should be technically lower quality, like, it's going- it's taking one more step. Music. Ready? Go. No, it should be perfect now, because you're hearing what I'm hearing. Less the modification of like my volume settings, but no, this is like a direct feed of what I hear. It's freaking weird. That's that's one thing I really don't like about streaming. Every time I change anything, it's always fucked up. No matter what it, I change, basically. Oh right, I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to play. The, I've forgotten that I was using this character that you can't control. I was doing that thing where you like, give your little cousin the control, or you give them the, like, the player two controller and you're still playing, you're like, oh no, you're playing. You're really good. Yeah, no, this character, Sleepwalking Rin, is, she sleepwalks. So she just gets an absolute 100% perfect every single time. Which is a shame because I really like this outfit, but... Of all of the games to screw up the audio though, a music game. Hopefully it, all, it wasn't all as bad as that one track, because the one I heard was really bad. I was like, damn, you're doing really good! Oh no, this is me! This is, yeah, I just got really good. There's Evil Guru, who looks like not even human because her arms, like, what's even happening there? It's like a teddy bear. Yeah. Well, she's got like, <laughs> she's got like the Homer Simpson glasses. It's like one of those like, Cover your eyes when you're sleeping things, so it's got eyes painted on it. It's a good costume. I like Rin in general. I'm not sure I could pick a favorite of the characters, they're all really good. Alright, let's pick a character I can actually control. It's my turn! Dare I do six?
one unfortunate thing about the DLC is the DLC is like all extremely hard songs. Like not all, but like 95%. So like as they add more content, like none of it's going to be like nice and easy for tiny babs like me. It's just a bunch of songs that like this is like the lowest difficulty. I think there's one song that actually starts with seven as the lowest difficulty. I like what that track does with the... You gotta hop over the thing when it's doing the, the little jumpy sound effect thing. Do those laptop cooler things like even work? I was always really skeptical of those. This one? Yes. Polymath 9. W what happened to Polymath 8? Cooler, it's supposed to be better. <laughs> Believable. <laughs> voice is way different. Christmas present. Christmas present. Let's spare Ren her shame. Let's see you, farmer. I like that we've established who among us are completely deaf and unable to tell if I have ruined the sound settings. This is the crypt I was talking about. I love the look at the look at the background for the horny skeletons. I'm not kidding. I mean everything in this place is horny. I mean the boss is a sucky bus, what do you expect? Why you're not allowed to manually activate fever on this version. You can do that on mobile, and I was hoping they would add an update, but not so far. The other guy said he was gonna ask the devs, but never heard back. I wish this game would tell you which map, or like which thing does which map. That part of the song I'm talking. Um, because I tend to really like songs that have this map. Now all of the all of the skeletons are horny. Like if you look in the background, you will see them. Going pad, knock my temps down 15 to 20 degrees, huh? Eat the logo. Just eat it. I like how you keep leveling up for no reason other than to be like, hey, I'm higher level than you. I have played this game more than you. You plebe? You can't. You can barely hear the like, let's go. 
thingy. I'm curious what the hell is the deal with the, the audio situation here, though. That is so weird. I wonder if the new firmware beat something up. Software. There's like no audio options. Whatever. I should just not use that option. Uh, I think we played everything. Okay, so This is the Russian one. You can tell because it's called Conflict. Cranky. <laughs> Cranky! It's called Conflict and one of the artist's name is Cranky. It's the most Russian song ever. And it's like... Snowflakes? Question mark? And whatever this art thing is. Let's do... I hate picking all these level 6 and above ones. So I know I'm not gonna do well. Ready? Go. It took me like 15 replays to get a. In a desperate conflict <laughs> with a ruthless enemy. Um, to get a full combo on uh, K Fig, and I really like that song. Speaking of music, there's a new uh, Rammstein album out. Out like a couple months ago now. Uh, I just ordered it on Amazon. Oh fuck. Yeah, there it goes. Oh, I hate that switch. Speaking of switch, the, the lanes are kind of switch colored, aren't they? I do like the this game is really designed in a way that um if you're at least trying you're usually gonna at least finish the song even on the really hard ones. Cause only specific types of misses actually do damage. Something has to actually hit you. I'm just talking about moose and squirrel. This is the song they sing when they have to fight moose and squirrel. <laughs> That's the Sega font, by the way. The developers definitely like Sonic the Hedgehog. There's a lot of Sonic nods. We talked about that in an earlier stream, but it's definitely a thing. I haven't seen this one in the stream yet. <laughs> Reading them legs. Um, there's any ones I haven't done yet. That one. I think I finished all the DLC ones. One of these easy. <laughs> I like this. I like this background image. 20% video games, 20% porn dojins, 60% candy and teddy bears. That's that's pretty much me. Just swap the candy and teddy bears percentage with the video games. That's me. Look, 
this loading screen too. I like all of the loading screens really. This is the the only one I don't like is the humans yeah. one, the real human meat one. All of the other ones are really good. Some are better than others, but I wouldn't say any. Even the even the one I don't like isn't bad. It's just. Oh, yeah, stream tomorrow for um, we're streaming the LSD Dream Emulator. First LSD stream, I think, in like a year. Um, I still got my save file. I don't know how close we are to beating it. Um, you can beat it, yes. You have to do a whole year's worth of dreams. Then you get a special FMV. Um, there are a few things that we haven't gotten. There's like this huge guide. And by huge, I mean it's like... Uh, I guess I'm talking... It's like 300 pages, but um, it has a ton of info in the game. And so I'll be checking some of that out in that stream. Chat room, what the hell, Twitch? Why is it walking me to the chat room? Three, two, one. Must have had a Twitch glitch. Do real violin things have the like hand guard? It just makes it look like a sword. <laughs> I'm not sure violin string things are supposed to be that badass. It's got like a hilt. You usually have to refresh because you're put in some sort of shadow chat realm. Yeah, I've been in the shadow chat realm sometimes. I always get paranoid when not anyone when nobody's talking for a minute. I always get paranoid that I've been put into the realm. This is another one of those. This is the Sega one. The, the Sonic 3 save select, specifically. Which we discussed before is apparently French. It's French. <laughs> like, because you're just being painted on in that one. And she just doesn't care. Look at how horny the skeletons are. It's intense. Best part of the song right here. One of the things some of the harder songs try to do to mix you up is those fuckers that come from like off screen, like that pumpkin. This like jumps out of the water, or blood, or whatever that is. Horny juice, succubus fluids.
I'm definitely not gonna beat or like full combo every master difficulty, but I at some point I would like to unlock all of them. Especially the ones that have less than six. And for the hard difficulty. Invader. What's all the music for the backgrounds of some of these? Wish they had like an art gallery for these, not just the uh, Modi screen. Is, is this something from some anime or game or something? Because some of these have like their own anime videos. Uh, anything I can unlock? No, I don't want to do those. I could probably do this one. Let's go. Let's go back to some of the songs I actually know how to do. Uh, I, I do the little devil one, but it's like impossible. It's <laughs> if the song doesn't have enough beats per minute. Uh oh, MediaCom. If the song has doesn't have enough beats per minute, it's genuinely impossible to beat a song. With Yeah, oh no, is the artist that does a lot of the uh, Chinese work ones that I like a lot. What else have they got? <laughs> I love the name V. Oh, it's Vita. I thought it was Vegeta Crush. Vegeta! I'd, I'd listen to songs by Vegeta Crush. I think this one's another one. Alright, here we go. Play all along so perfectly. I'm so bad at that for some reason. Let's be different. Uh, sure. <laughs> I like how she goes, Bwah! Not really boo, but Bwah. Bwah! Bobby? I'm a zombie, Bobby. I like this new generation of brains. Ready? Go! I'm so sad that we never got a King of the Hill game. Before I die, I want someone to make a stealth action game where you play as Rusty Shackleford and you have pocket sands. It's too perfect. Someone at least make like a Metal Gear Solid like ROM hack. ISO hack, whatever.
I just have to be Rusty Shackleford with some good old fashioned pocket sand. I like the like almost Game Boy colors. Oh man, what was that game? I played a Kickstarter like Game Boy aesthetic kind of situation. Um, uh, whatever happened to that thing? I'll have to look up my own video because I don't remember what the hell that was called. But it was really cool. Still dropping 1% of frames even at this invisible bitrate. It's not that bad though, right? Go. It could look even better if I wasn't doing 60 FPS. I should probably just give up. Give up on the 1080p 60 FPS dream. Should give up on the talking while playing this game dream. It's just casually being painted on. Zero intercourse is given. This one's with the, the human one. I don't like this one as much. It's not bad though. It's got almost like a jet set poster kind of look to it though. Reminds me. I need to. I need to catch up on Fully Cooly. Was it good? 
follicly progressive and alternative and whatever. I didn't realize those just like came out. I love the original. Oh freaking! By the way, um, there's there's gonna be a new Invader Zim. Uh, Netflix is gonna make a new season of Invader Zim. So that should be good. It's one of those things where if it was made today, I feel like there's no way it would have ever got canceled. Well, I mean, not ever, but like. It's like a less edgy, like, Rick and Morty or something, kind of like that. I just think it would be really big. I always find it weird that people are like really surprised when I swear in streams and stuff. But I feel like I swear way too often. I try not to. But it happens like all the time. I guess if people don't hear like it's like the first word out of my mouth is not like every single swear word in existence. Like a lot of YouTube channels. They just assume I don't do it at all. Moderation is not appreciated in aspect of things, I guess. Did I get new Twitter? Yeah, I have new Twitter. And it's dumb and pointless. Why not, like, at least have the top bar? It's so weird to not have a top bar. Why didn't we get this one? It feels weird hearing English in this game, honestly. Music. Oh hey. Ready? It's Fedora Land again. Go. I swear that is like two dogs fucking up on that that roof there. That is not appropriate for children. I mean the rest of this game is horny on main anyway, but I really like- I really appreciate- this game has like the exact amounts of horny and cute at the same time. That it's like, perfectly in tune to me. This is my hole, it was made for me. Oh, fuck, it's a tap. But yeah, there is a way, if you hate new Twitter as much as most people do, um, you can spoof a user agent on your desktop and uh, get around it. I think it only affects the, the Twitter tab. At least on Chrome, fuck. <laughs> Should talk. How long was I streaming with the audio messed up? That's gonna bug me, because I, I don't think I can, I, I can't edit that really. I'm just gonna stop trying to use the direct audio feed, because for some reason it always goes wrong every time. It's either too loud, too quiet, or I put both on so there's an echo, or just... Ugh. His ears just look like dinner plates. They're just dinner plates stuck into the wig. Yeah. Oh, it also makes me kind of think, like... <laughs> Say 
about an hour? Oh, jeez. Hopefully it wasn't that bad. I don't think there's really any audio way to correct that. Garbage in, garbage out, really. Oh, these ones are all ridiculous. This one starts out with a seven. Let's see what achievements I'm missing. By the way, if anyone knows if there's more secret loading screens, I feel like there aren't, but if there are, let me know. I only found one. You get one for beating milk, basically. It's a... Uh, where is it? Give up treatment hidden. It's the only hidden one I've found. By the way, getting a C rank is, like, harder than getting an S rank. I, it took me three tries to get a C rank. It's hard. I'm gonna go baby mode. Where'd Parker go? He's not annoying me anymore. Ready? Go! Yeah, I'm gonna kinda try to bring back uh, chill Wednesday streams. Starting this Wednesday, we're gonna be doing uh, some LSD with the game. LSD Dream Emulator. You can do some LSD if you want, but you know, be responsible. No unresponsible LSD uses on my stream, buddy. Um, if you've never seen it before, I think you'll really like it. It's really interesting. And there's a game like LSD, a lot like LSD, on PS1, in fact. I think it was called. I have it in my favorites bar, though. That's where I kind of shove everything. Just fuck off, dubstep. Um, that's where I kind of shove everything I need to play eventually. So it's got like 3,000 items in it. Probably only a minor exaggeration at this point. Yeah. It's definitely several hundred. But it's this Japanese only thing, it's like a mystery game? But it's really surreal and weird, and it's not- there's no ending apparently? It's in Japanese, of course, but it- I don't think that matters a ton, because it seems like it's more like LSD than it is like, say, I don't know, Danganronpa. Wait, oh yeah, that's what I was trying to say earlier. Uh, Danganronpa, a series I really like, but I don't know if I could ever do videos of it, because like, they're so freaking long and there's so much talking involved, and so much reading. Like, I would have to stream it like full time for like a month. For like 60 hours or something. They're really good though. I marathoned the first two. Um, right around the when the second one came out on Vita. I'll play the third one yet, though. Oh, the cat is licking me to death with his razor tongue. He loves you. Why again? I just don't like tracks as much on the, the later DLCs. I like the original music better. Leave it alone. Good track name. I like the original style there, though. Little trillular fingers. For some reason, the ranking isn't online by default. But there's no way I'm ever gonna get anywhere near anything ever in the ranking now. Look at that. I'm a solid place 492. And people get crazy accuracy even on super high difficulties. It's ridiculous. I think they're robots, honestly.
really feels like it should have been the town one. The jazzy town. Not this one. But this one just seems to get precedence for everything. Like, this really isn't sweet- Oh, fuck. This is quite good for talking. This really isn't, like, sweet kawaii music at all. I was reading chat that time. I was- I was already doomed. Why- why fuck with it? my ranking by 200 whole slots. Did some game lose their, lose their stuff or something again? Oh, by the way, when I first saw this, it Achieve five dash misjudgments. I thought you had to achieve five or more. No, it's five minus. I've never seen five minus, like five plus to mean like five or more, but I've never seen five minus to mean five or less. Special version of Super Mario Bros. with world maps. Unless it's a teleview. Oh, yeah, there's a bunch of interesting stuff on Satellaview. I think almost all of it is actually preserved, surprisingly. But yeah, you can download Satellaview stuff and uh, play it in an emulator. There was this weird, like, Link to the Past thing. And there goes my ability to talk. I love the flute. We're gonna go fucking save King Aragorn. Certain instruments I just can't take seriously. They just take me back to like, they just feel so genre specific. And flutes just make me think of like hobbits and like Robin Hood and crap. Very tight cast. It's being tight cast. Why the hell is this in this level? I swear that this is just the default level, and they just never change it for like over 50% of the songs. Uh, this one I can kind of see in this one though. It might be better in the crypt one. I don't know. I've been playing some Logo Roku too. It was really cheap in the PlayStation sale that I think just ended today. It was a pretty good sale, by the way. I had to stop myself from getting some stuff. But I didn't even know they had Logo Roku Remastered 2. Hopefully we get uh, Patapon 2 and 3. Those are the really good ones. Patapon 1 was a brilliant idea, but like ball-crushingly hard and a little bit too simple. Uh, but Patapon 2 is absolutely fantastic. Patapon 3 is a little bit weird. It got a bit Monster Hunter-y. And it was still good, I still played a lot of it, but, um... I didn't enjoy it as much. There was some weird grindiness, and like... I don't know, it'd be hard to describe right now, because I haven't played it in like, 10 years. Breaking news. What does that say? Oh, Brain Power. I thought it said Brain Pocket. That's a pretty good band name, honestly.
I feel like that one is gonna get me content ID immediately. It's a cute song though. I can just feel the content ID sneaking up on me. Uh, let's be a different person. Let's be. Ding. Sure. This particular version of SMB was not preserved unless someone signs it. Music. Yeah, the thing about the Teleview stuff is that if you had a cart yeah. that had last loaded that game, you can still get it. Um, I think voice clips might have only been, like, I don't know if those got downloaded too. But all of the Zelda stuff and a bunch of weird Kirby stuff has been preserved. I think they have all of the weird... I think they have all of the weird Kirby stuff preserved. There's like a bunch of mini games and stuff. This one would have been a bitch to hear with that awful, like, bass yeah. boost glitch that we had before. Or it would have sounded unchanged, I'm not really sure. I don't know if they edit it just for the game, but it's fucking impossible to hear the lyrics of this song. I don't think it's very important, but... I always fuck up with this part. I didn't even know there was a Mario Bros. to tell of you thing. I think there was like a Sega Channel thing too? For Genesis or something that was basically the same kind of deal? I have no idea what that song has to do with a sweet witch girl. It's the only thing I can intelligize. Intelligible fate is um, rock this, and then just says rock like 50 times. Music. Ready? It's a Tell of You, Sega Channel, and Dreamcast. Oh, Dreamcast! Was it Dreamcast? No, I thought it was earlier than Dreamcast. Uh, there was a Dreamcast thing for sure, but I don't, th I don't think that was Sega Channel. Could be wrong though. This song got me back in the scooter. Downloaded a bunch of it to my phone. I forgot, I forgot it has fucking dubstep. The scooter probably has like dubstep stuff now at this point, don't they? I haven't really kept up on Scooter since, uh, college. I hope they're still making stuff, but, uh, I'm amazed that Rammstein still is. When they made their fourth album, I kind of thought they were gonna, like, stop making stuff. But they made, a, like, three since then, I think? Um... Deutschland, um, Nibis for Alida, and the new one that's just called Rammstein, again. Even though I think one of their first albums was just called Rammstein. 
So I think one is technically untitled and one is actually called Rammstein. Does it really help in naming it? Shitty and confusing name seems to be a common pretentious music thing. Like that fucking Kanye West album that's just like, you know, somebody had a fucking aneurysm and a copy of MS Paint, and that's the cover art. Like someone was trying to learn how to rotate paint, and they were trying to learn how to fuck. That's why I get for talking. You know the one I mean. Um... Um, if you've ever seen this, I'm sure you know what I'm talking about. Oh, it has an ass on it. I'm so I can't show that one. Let me give you the censored version. I didn't know there was an ass on it. Oh, this one's even better. But it's basically this. There's an ass on the real one that I can't show. But how do I rotate text in MS Paint? That's what I get. The, the, this is big rotate text in MS Paint vibes. Can I rotate? Can I rotate text in, in... No, not that way. In OBS. How to rotate text in OBS. I can rotate like... Like this way, but not like like by increments whatever but it looks incredible it, it looks visionary you don't respect artistry This reminds me so much of Jet Set Radio, that, that loading screen. I couldn't get into Jet Set Radio, by the way. I'm sorry. I tried to play it on uh, Vita. It wasn't really my kind of thing. Love the mood and everything. Like, the gameplay was weird and not what I was expecting. I feel like I missed the bus on a lot of Sega stuff. Right click the source transform edit rotation, rotation input box. Gotcha. Transform. Edit transform. Oh sweet! I just learned how to rotate text and MSP! Amazing. This is quality streams. This is how you stream, my friends. Amazing. You're crazy. Somebody, told me. Somebody once told me. Sorry. Sega Channel was an online service with all my Sega's for the Genesis. Yeah, that's what I thought. There was an online thing. I had to plug into our freaking modem for the um if you can fight the Dreamcast online thing. I think I downloaded like a chow item and like that's all. Maybe there's like a was it like choo choo rocket levels you could download? I I basically never used it. It wasn't my first online game though. I played um, very, very little um, Unreal Tournament. I played that pretty much like 99% offline. I would download like single player mods and stuff. Um, and there was some RTS games I tried to play online, but we just had we just didn't have enough. We didn't have enough bits. We had sub mediacom internet, as terrifying as that is. 
Swarm. What is Swarm? Hey, Extremes. I have not heard of Squirm. Squirm game, I guess. Looks like a shitty horror movie. Game of Squirms. What? This does not appear to be a game. I like that she only has, like, underwear in, like, non-plausibly deniable situations. Like, look at this. See, no... <laughs> No apparent underwear, and then in-game, when there's no more plausible deniability, it just happens. Sega Netlink. Attachment for the Sega Saturn? I, I need to, like, get- I want to get a Sega Saturn. I want to get the weird consoles that I never got as a kid. I also need to re-get the consoles I did have, because I was a dumbass and I gave them away. I don't know what I was thinking. I thought emulation would be enough. But no, that's bullshit. It'll- You'll always want your games. Never, never sell a game console, in my opinion. There's never been one that I've sold and not regretted. Um, sold my PS2, because hey, the PS3 has backwards compatibility. But then my fat PS3 died, and I have a Slim now, so... I have to emulate, and emulation for PS2 was a little bit fucky. Um, I sold my GameCube because the Wii completely replaced it, but... I only got 20 bucks for that, and I had to spend 20 bucks again to, like, get another, um, GameCube controller. So, complete waste. And that was my best sell, honestly, that was... That was the one I've regretted the least. Because the Wii still does pretty much replace it, it's just, I should have just kept my controllers. But I was a college kid, and I was really desperate for money, so I would, like... Anything I was done, I would sell, and I would, like, rent games a lot. And now, when you're in college, it's, like, only way to play games, so, like, why not? I have not rented games since college, in fact. In fact, I rented that super rare... Fire Emblem game that's like a hundred dollars or more now. I should have like just kept that, but I had no idea it would be rare, of course. Should have snagged that in Cube of War. Oh fuck. Almost game. Um I think of Cube of War. That's and Seaman for uh Dreamcast are games I really want to stream sometime. Does Seaman stream properly? That would be a good cursed content stream, actually. It's a really weird, like, man-person meat fish. Like, raising sim. It's like a fish with, like, an old Japanese man's face, and you, like, raise it. And I don't remember a lot more than that. But it's cool. It mixes my, f my love of weird things with my love of, like, fish things. Reminds me, a fish, an aquarium game just came out on Steam that I was supposed to be checking out. But I was doing a stream today, so I can't. Mics. Oh yeah, it's a microphone based game, isn't it? I'm not sure if that's necessarily the case. It really depends how the game does the mic. I think Hey You Pikachu, like, there's processing, like, in the mic or some crap? Or in, like, the attachment? Because, like, it doesn't come... I don't know. Emulating it was really weird. Or, I think it's like, you can't do it. But I have a physical copy of that. So then we'll do a cursed content stream with, uh... Hey, you Pikachu at some point. I actually really loved that game as a kid, though. But I'll get a real Dreamcast at some point, anyway. Oh 
She has my favorite um, track. Bruno has all of the best tracks of like the characters here. I love the tongue stick out face. Let me look this up real quick. I mean, let's really listen to this. There is an emulator for PC that supports microphones and can play C-Man on your PC. Shut up, computer thing. But yeah, C-Man costs like $300 or more now, I think. But, yeah. I've never heard of this emulator, but... to try it at some point. Seaman's really cool though. Let me show you. Seaman. Just for those that have no idea what the hell I'm talking about. Um, the best thing I can show you is probably just this image. He's my- he's our friend now. He's- he's the new Elfin. I think they were eventually gonna make, like, a sequel? Seaman? I would love that. I want that now. Apparently he can get, like, legs and be, like, a frog. Or, like, a lizard. That's terrifying. So someday, maybe. Mediacom? Are we doing this again? Are we- are we okay? still bad. Okay, we're gonna have to stop. Fucking hell. It's so bad! It just suddenly got so bad! Can you even hear me? I think it's like... Alright, let me get this off screen for you. <sighs> it got- the berry just suddenly got so bad! And it's right around 8! I swear, the-, the... <sighs> Whatever was happening in 2017 is like, back. Whatever. I'm gonna wrap up the stream here because it's just gonna get more infuriating and s at some point. Okay, yeah, it does look pretty bad too. I was wondering how this would look. It probably looked better at 60 or at 30 FPS. It looks like a it looks like a GIF from like 1995. 
but yeah, we need calm. Sucks butt. Sorry about that, but um, what are you gonna do? Good night, everybody. Uh, LSD stream tomorrow. Let me get a link to that, because I made an event. You can make series on Twitch now, too. So I made like a series for Chill Wednesday. I made a series for uh, Cursed Content. And one for Board Game Night. Oh, wow. When the switch d dims, you can see it on the stream, too. Anyway, that's tomorrow night's stream. It'll start at 6. Um, LSD should be a lot more impervious to Mediacom bad stream quality than this game is, so... Well, good night, everybody. Hope to see you tomorrow.